Hello. He's nearly lost his voice. <laughs> I hear you cry, Yahoo! <laughs> I am full of the cold. <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> right, so we're, what date is it? The May the 14th. 14th. May, Friday, May the 14th. And off we're going, we're doing a wild camp again this evening. Um, and then, which is Cambridge Way. Again. Um, with Bob and Jan. Yeah, we're meeting again. with Bob and Jan. Channel favourites. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then over the weekend, um, we're um, we're going to uh, Lowestoft to Nest Point, which is the most east easterly point on the UK mainland. Um, so I'm told. It is true. I think this one's a true rather than a made-up head of facts. It's true. It's um, true. Uh, uh, then we're heading down to um, Southwold. Then we've got the weekend at Polstead um, Camping and Caravanning Club site. Not just the weekend. Um, and Monday, Tuesday, well, Monday, Monday night, so we, we leave Tuesday. What's so special so, about Tuesday, I hear you cry. <laughs> Everybody the, sing happy birthday to me. <laughs> yes, it's Rick's birthday on Tuesday. Oh, 29. Uh, <laughs> how's it? Is that for Liam? So, but yeah, so um, uh, we're making... Don't forget what we're going to do, the most important Bloody thing, hell, come on. Not, just give me a chance, will you? <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to Framlingham, which is where they uh, filmed Detectress, which is one of Rick's favourite um, comedy programmes. Um, and uh, we're going to go to a few places, Framlingham and uh, Orford, which uh, are, are different areas around that area. And that's why we chose Polstead. Um, uh, it's a little bit away from actually Framlingham, but it's, it's still close enough to uh, to do what we want to do. Um, We've got a lot of driving this weekend. Uh, uh, um, but uh, yeah, a lot of navigating. Anyway, too much talking. Oh, too much talking. They'll get bored, they'll have turned off by now. <laughs> um, Righto, hopefully you can hear me with my sultry voice. Uh, we waited for this car to go that was parked where we are, spun round. Bob said they had a lot of rain last night, um, obviously. It's the flatlands around here, isn't it? Where they've all got web feet. Um, so normally this car park wouldn't be too bad, but we've managed to get on a dry park there. And Bob's on a dry park there. So yeah, it's very, very quiet. I think we'll uh, not be disturbed tonight unless the dog has come down. <laughs> Apparently. There we go. There's Jan, look. Give us a wave, Jan. Seen yourself on the telly last week, didn't you? Yeah, I didn't see that, did I? You didn't tell us there was a swimming pool, Bob. <laughs> Are you looking for doggers? Yeah. You got this thing about doggers, is that what you is that what you do in your van? Yeah. He's filming you, Bob. Is he? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I bet he doesn't put the doggers coming in. I bet he does. Ricky goes dogging, is that right? Is that what we got? Yeah, it's Enid Blyton's most failed book, that was. <laughs> what are you doing here? You, you turn around every time you turn around, he's filming you. Yeah, but I don't use it all, do I? I'm sometimes waiting for an, a nugget of wisdom that I can use. <laughs> it's no good coming here for facts either. No, well, <laughs> uh, uh, unbeknown to the viewers, I've been filming him for four hours. <laughs> We're still waiting for... He's got his camera out now, Wise look words. in case the doggers do come. That's what it is. Anyway. Well, I've got the camera out because uh, not a lot of people know this about the bittern, but the bittern does actually do acts. It does like a, a, a play thing. Yeah? Sort of yeah, stand where it will... If, I mean, if it, if it was going from those reeds to those reeds, quite often they'll do it, like a chorus girl thing. Oh, yeah. Which is quite a rare behaviour. Is this true? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, you just 
<laughs> or it might be one of Heather's made up facts that I borrowed off of her. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Well, these have grown, haven't they? These spring in hells. Yeah, they were already sort of knee high, weren't they? Yeah, do you want to go and lock Skippy up if you're worried? Yeah, I'm Hello. Yes, I still have my croaky voice. So calm yourself, ladies, calm yourselves. Um, just taking the dogs out this morning. Bob and Jan are still asleep. Old people need more sleep, you see. Uh, Heather's just getting sorted in the van. Then we're off to Lowestoft, Southwold. Is it Southwold? I think it's called Southwold, isn't it? Um, then we'll go to Polstead, find the site, get it set up, and then tomorrow is Framlingham and associated areas on my detectorist tour. Um, so yeah, busy lot of driving this weekend. So Monday, I don't plan on doing a great deal. We'll just stay on the site on Monday and then go home Tuesday, do it all again next week. <laughs> There we go. Just beeping goodbye to Bob and Jack. So, hello everybody. Hello. Um, so that was our wild camp um, night, and now we're heading towards Lowest Off to um, Nest Point, as we said. Um, and um, it's raining, unfortunately. But it's only just started. Um, but I think it's um, in <laughs> for the uh, duration, unfortunately. <laughs> so we're just coming into Lowest Off. Uh, got to do a, a fuel fill up. Um, and we're heading towards Asda. Not then, the Asda. Hey. Not Some quite. people call it the Asda, don't they? Oh, do they? And it's not the Asda, it's just Asda. You don't say we're going to the Morrisons, do you? I didn't know you said going to the Asda. Yeah, people say the Asda. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Shut up. Sorry. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're going to the Asda. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> oh. um, to fill up with diesel and then we're going to Nest Point. <laughs> so we'll see you shortly. <laughs> So that is the most easterly point. You can just see in the picture the little cream coloured part of the landmark thing. And then as you're looking directly there, Amsterdam's the next piece of land 113 miles away. So there you go. I don't think we've got a long enough run up to make it, but um, <laughs> there we are. It's very underwhelming. But it's in the middle of industrial estate, <laughs> yeah. it's weird. We do this so you don't have to. It's not the most romantic place in the world. Well, in the UK. <laughs> this is as east as you can go. It's in the middle of an industrial estate. It's, you know, there's 
the, uh, the famous landmark. I'm going to stand on that and then bugger off. as close as I can get her without doing a run up. Yeah, it's uh, not the tourist hotspot that they make Land's End and John O'Groats. <laughs> but this is the first of, we're gonna try and do all four points this year. Get the van as close as we can to them. That's it then, that's Lowestoft done. Unlike Land's End and John O'Groats, I don't think we'll come back. No <laughs> offence, Lowestoft, but... I don't know, it looked quite nice in the, in the town, but yeah. obviously with it being a, a The thing is, a port, this has been the most easterly point forever, so why didn't they make it something flashy then? <laughs> I don't know, weird. <laughs> anyway. So, we're just coming so, 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 what we, are you, John and Mandy? We're just coming down. Hello, we're just coming down <laughs> into Southwold. <laughs> um, we're going to go to the pier, which is at the north of uh, the seafront, and then we're going to go um, a little bit further south where there's a chippy. <laughs> no, for lunch. So, we'll show you the pier when we get there. Oh look, all them beach road things. Is that what you've come here for? Yeah. Just to see them? Well no, we'll see the seafront and then this. Alright, I'm only cheesing. I'm only cheesing. Oh no high barriers this time. It's safe. Just to be daring. As you can see, all of the lovely beach huts, all nicely painted. Heather's made up fact of the day. This is the actual clock used to set British summertime to. <laughs> Where's Captain Jack? <laughs> hey, Poppy! <laughs>
go. I've got their own pop chips, <laughs> their own fish cake, and you've got haddock. Okay, so that's us finished in. Excuse me, start again. <laughs> right, so that's us finished in South World. We just had some lovely fish and chips. <laughs> start again. <laughs> We're, um, it's a bit breezy here, as yeah. you can probably tell. <laughs> Our Rick's hair, <laughs> he's cold ears. It's freezing. It's freezing. <laughs> um, start, uh, start from now, clap, clap. Oh. Go. Say it. Say. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> watch well, far too much John and Mandy. No, I say so with that. I don't need them to I mean, prompt me to say so, you know. Oh, so, okay. Um. Um. Right then. <laughs> Go on. Right then. That's us finished in Southwold. We've just had some lovely, lovely fish and chips. We're now heading to Polstead, where you'll see us on another video. Please. Like and subscribe. That's rubbish, man. That is rubbish. <laughs> you do it then. Oh, I'll do it, even though I've got a bad throat. <clears throat> right. So that is it for the wild camp. The visit oh, to wow. lovely Lower Stoft. <laughs> you want to go there, yeah? It's great. Industry. Look, what are you doing? Oh. <laughs> you nothing. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Have you finished now? <laughs> Jesus, I can't hardly speak. <laughs> Stop it. Just carry on. Right, yeah, you're not the one that has to edit it. Right, then. Shh. <laughs> right, so that is us done with um, the wild camp that we did with Bob and Jan. Thanks again, Bob and Jan, for the uh, free camping. Then we did lovely Lower Stoft, <laughs> Industrial Estate Heaven. Great. We did it so you didn't have to. And then we've just done Southwold, great fish and chips which we decided we were going to have after we saw John and Mandy and Life Beyond Bricks and Daz the Urban Motorhome having. Great, that was lovely. We loved that, didn't we? Mm -hmm. So now we're off to Polstead Camping and Caravanning Club site, which you'll see on a separate video because there's far too much waffle on this one. <laughs> so we'll catch you on the next one. Bye-bye. Bye, everybody.